Hello and welcome to another episode of the Two Brew Review. This week we are checking out the official Slammer, Slammers, Slammers Lager. Uh, this is from the folks down at Workforce Brewing Company out of Plainfield, which is uh, southwestern suburbs uh, near Joliet in the Joliet State Correctional Institute. Uh, I really think this is a cool uh, marketing and labeling of this product because as you can see, it's a uh, got a baseball theme to it because it is brewed for the Joliet Slammers uh, baseball team, but obviously uh, Slammers and uh, some of the cool uh, decoration here with the brick wall and the barbed wire um, fencing. Um, it's also giving a dual nod, not only to baseball, but also prison reference. And for those of us who have uh, watched uh, Blues Brothers far too many times, um, we all know about the Joliet, Joliet State Correctional Facility. So uh, pretty cool marketing, but what's inside the can that counts, right? So let's check this out. Uh, 16 ounce can, um, uh, American lager, brewed with Pilsner malt. Uh, Pilsner is a very versatile uh, two row pale lager malt. Uh, it's very light in color, gives kind of a soft, sweet flavor profile. And then it says it's hopped with uh, uh, Czech Saz hops. That's considered one of the European noble hops. Uh, mild aromas and bitterness, again, used in uh, lagers and uh, lighter fare, such as what we'll probably find in this can um, and fermented with lager yeast. So um, bo bottom fermenting yeast that, uh, that tends to produce a cleaner, uh, cleaner, more refreshing product. So let's go ahead and tear into this guy as we would expect by the grain bill and the fact that it's a, a kind of a summertime lager. We're getting that nice straw yellow color. Um, thin white head, it's going to dissipate pretty quickly. It's, pretty, it's supported by all of the, the effervescence. Uh, summertime thirst quenching lagers like this, you do you have a high amount of carbonation in them and this is definitely um, showing us a lot of nucleation and carbonation. Oh, getting the the, the, those uh, bready, malty uh, aromatics, a little touch of floral hop, also a little touch of fruitiness in there too. Cheers. There, sweet malt flavor. Um, again, get a little bit of the, the the noble hops in there to give it a little bit of a of a of a of a backbone to cut through some of that sweet malt. Um, again, get a little bit of fruitiness in this as well. Yeah, the, again, I think the hops tends to wash the sweetness and the fruitiness away, but it's got a little more fruit character. It's something that you would find more in, in ale yeast, which tend to produce those fruit-like esters. This has got a touch of that in there. Um, but, you know, it's very uh, refreshing, light-bodied. Um, again, the finish um, is, is sweet. I'm getting a little bit of the hops and, again, the fruit bite in the end. So again, a little bit more ale-like in some of its character, but also very refreshing, very thirst quenching. This would be great, you know, watching a, a baseball game on a hot summer day. Um, unremarkable, but it's not meant to be in your face. It's meant to be kind of a gateway beer. So if you're looking for uh, something that's not mass produced, but something lighter and refreshing, this would definitely fill the bi fill the bill. So. There you have it. It's the official Slammers Lager from Workforce Brewing out of Plainfield. Uh, I think this ties together what this country is all about. Beer, baseball, and federal incarceration. Hope everybody has a safe and happy 4th of July holiday. Cheers.